Hello guys, a lot of you asked me to make a video how to install Far Cry mods, so okay, I will show you a quick tutorial how to install it. First of all, you have to type Far Cry modding in your server bar. After that, you have to go to their site. And next, the Nolan's mod here. And it depends which Far Cry games you want to use. We will choose uh, Far Cry 5 in this video because this is the most popular version of Far Cry but you can do this that way, exactly that way, step by step with any Far Cry game for example Far Cry 4 or New Dawn So let's begin with Far Cry 5 After you see this you have to install Far Cry Mod Installer First of Node and next install You go there and click here Downloadland for Windows. Contains only mod installer without any mods. Okay. After you download, you have to extract it. Extract it. So we will extract with WinRAR. You can do it. Do this with 7-zip also. Extract here and we have our mod installer already on desktop. So yeah, after that We have to install mods for Far Cry 5. So we will go back there And we will download resistance mod pack We go scroll down scroll down and Don't know want resistance mod contains only resistance mod have to wait a few seconds okay once it's finished Wait a bit. Okay, there it is. We have to extract it also like previously. Extract here. Okay, and we can uh, copy our file. Go to modified in Far Cry mod installer. Go to modified uh, files Far Cry 5 and just paste it. And if you would like to do this with Far Cry 4, Far Cry 3, 6, you simply don't know land it uh, from Far Cry 4, for example, Golden Path mod. You don't know land mod and you put it into Far Cry modified files Far Cry 4 you do this basically with every Far Cry mod and after you after we put that file into our folder we have to just uh, open Far Cry, Far Cry 5 mod installer.exe so we open that we choose uh, language continue Okay, as you can see, the mod automatically detected uh, my game, but uh, path of my game. It's automatically detected path of my game, but for some reason, sometimes it uh, might not find your path, so it will be notification uh, about that, and you will have to just uh, press uh, a button and uh, search uh, in search for your exe file of your Far Cry 5. So if you would have that issue, you just uh, have to find your folder of Far Cry 5 and uh, pick exe. But it shouldn't happen. I think this mod is uh, really nice updated now. And <laughs> uh, recently when it happened to me, it was like a very, very long time ago. So it should automatically uh, find your path for a Far Cry game. So after you see this uh, this window, 
you just simply <laughs> uh, choose which mods you have to in you want to install. So for so for uh, example for the video, we'll pick some. Okay, we'll pick that. We'll pick that. We'll pick different icons for remake. Icons. So basically, this mod is huge, guys. You can. <laughs> <laughs> when I first time uh, used this mod, I spent like hour to uh, choose everything which I want because as you can see you can pick basically everything and everything is described very well on the right side of the screen. So you can pick some and, uh, and uh, just uh, check, check what you want. Mm -hmm. Okay, we show time, some A3 maybe. You can also search for mod. Uh, we will check if it's working. Maybe like that. So it maybe sometimes not work properly. Yes, yes, it sometimes may, might not work properly, but you can just scroll and uh, pick what you want. Okay. Basically, we, we, I will uh, choose basically something for the video, but uh, you can choose whatever you want. UI loading screen. Sometimes it can be read, uh, it uh, means that uh, some mods are conflicted. You can uh, sometimes you can't use uh, you can't use a few mods uh, together, so you, ca you have to pick only one from there. Toggle conflicts, and you can see there which uh, mods are conflict with each other. So if there is conflict, you have to pick only ones you want to use. Okay, let's see what else we can pick here. Well, basically, some stuff. Okay, I think it should be enough. And after you pick some mods, you just press install button. As you can see, mods are installing. Packages installed successfully. Now you can run the game. So we press OK. We can run the game from this window or we can just uh, run it from desktop or Steam. OK, run the game. As you can see, we already had a different start video. I will uh, turn volume down. Wait a few seconds. Okay, it should be better. Now let's enter the game. Oh, sorry. So you can see I picked some free stuff, so my game is loading differently. I have other icons also, uh, free icons. Also on the top of the screen you can see is different radar and on the left side corner, upper corner you can see time. <laughs> what else did I change? I don't remember but I think... No, I didn't change that. But as you can see, mods are working. You can pick from this. You can pick from this mod whatever you want. It just depends on the time you have, because this, like I said, this mod is huge, and you can pick everything uh, you want. It's, there is a lot of uh, mods for you. And if you want to uh, 
put after you install your mods and you want to add also some more mods you just basically click other mods you want to install okay we want to install that that and if you want to update your mods add more mods basically you press install and the mods will be installed everything will work correctly i swear okay installed successfully now you could run your game and uh, it will be working and if you want to remove some mod because you don't like it okay for example i don't like uh, this i don't like also this i don't like this so okay i unchecked it and press install and the mods which you don't like will be uninstalled and more mods if which you choose will be installed okay about this option uninstall mods i'm not sure but <laughs> i think it's 99 percent if you click that this uh, mod installer will simply uninstall all your mods which are currently installed so be very careful because uh, you can uninstall your mods with one or two clicks i think so be very careful with that option and i think it's uh, it's uh, everything for the video i hope you like it i hope uh, i helped you a bit with uh, <laughs> this uh, with basically install far cry mods and i think that's it thank you for the video guys and see you in the next Goodbye.